VR designer Chris here and today I'm going to give my review of episode 3 of the Expanse game by Telltale. Overall it was an emotional roller coaster with some interesting set pieces although it was shorter than the other episodes. I completed it in 37 minutes but I still think the episode was strong. I'm going to be breaking up this review into two sections one with spoilers and one without so I will give you a spoiler warning when there are spoilers. But for now, all I have to say is the introduction was good because we got right into exploration. I felt like in the last episode, we had a bit of exposition and a lot of talking before we got into the exploration, which I didn't like too much. This one, we get right into the action. We start off by exploring another ship with Maya, and we discover something pretty horrifying about something to do with the ship. I will we'll talk more about it when I go to uh, my spoiler part of the video. But but overall, I have to say I did enjoy the exploration and the set pieces in particular. Um, one specific area was very awesome and I did enjoy it quite a lot. The emotional roller coaster at the end is, uh, well, how can I say it? I was holding on to the edge of my seat. I was completely immersed and I thought the story element was very awesome, although tragic and it's emotionally draining, I guess is another word for it. Very good though, from a story standpoint, it was very interesting. But I'm about to go into spoiler territory, so if you don't wanna hear some spoilers, I would suggest clicking off the video and coming back after you play it. All right, so while we're exploring this ship, we find some interesting stuff about the past in the sense that this ship that we're exploring has tons of coffins with bodies in it. And these bodies are in a sort of stasis form in the sense that uh, they weren't necessarily supposed to die uh, and put in these coffins. They were supposed, supposed to be kept in these coffins and then being reanimated at some point. At least that's what I got from the episode. Um, I thought the regions that have all the coffins down the corridor looked very awesome. It, it's just like the Unreal Engine just <laughs> looks great. I thought they did a great job with that. And when it comes to the uh, emotional roller coaster ending, uh, of course, we're in spoiler territory now, but uh, the fact we get into an airlock with Maya and there's one helmet between the two of us and drummer needs to make a decision whether she keeps the helmet on herself or Maya but I feel like no matter what choice you make Maya is at this point she gets a shot and a little bit roughed up so she's not in great condition at this point she's bleeding out and uh, Maya unfortunately gets spaced and this comes to a really emotional point because in the previous episode we get to choose whether we want to spend the night uh, with Maya or not. I did choose to spend the night with Maya. That was my choice. And uh, the other really big choice in this episode is whether we fight or trust. Um, so I'm not exactly sure. I chose, I chose trust. Um, I'm not exactly sure what happens when you press fight. I wonder how that changes the episode. But uh, yeah, so maybe I'll do a follow-up video where I cover what all the choices do and how it changes the game. But at least what I experience is, uh, yeah, so don't feel bad for Maya. She got spaced, unfortunately, and uh, I cannot wait to see the rest of the episode because now, like, Drummer's stranded here on the ship, so I don't know how she's going to get herself out of this pickle. And, uh, yeah, so I'm looking forward to episode four. We are uh, over halfway there. I know there's another episode coming out with Abisarella, um, not exactly sure. They haven't given much information about that yet. Um, I think it comes out in November, but I might be wrong. We'll see. Uh, but yeah, thank you very much for watching. I got some more content coming on the way. And yeah, hope you enjoyed my thoughts on this episode three of the Expanse Telltale Games. So peace out.